on the first half. So let's see how it goes. Kawis already on the side. Spots his opponent, Luke. Gets him in the jungle, but immediately gets spotted by Shaz. He still tries to maintain this position, but look at this. Damage coming in from Broninho was lethal. Mel planted the bomb. Good news for Fury Academy for now. Fury Azen and ENG. Two people left. Dresden is extremely low HP, and KNG with Dolberetta is doing a real good job here in the kitchen. Might be the number two kill. No, it's not, but the problem is that 15 seconds on the clock. Not if Yusuke is available. KNG hitting Kai, and that's going to be also third kill for him, but look at the timer. The timer is lost already, and Zombie... Well, that's going to be a round for, Opla, or for Furia. KNG, another kill here. But look at the loop. There's going to be an, another one here. That's true. Also, Piriazin gets Kai in this gunfight. Mellow with the bomb. Was spotted in the window. Piriazin finished him. Trying to commit B side extremely aggressively and fast. So now the jungle loop may have some problems, but maybe not. Look at this. It's going to be triple kill. But not against Kawas. And Zombie also succeeds to get Piriazin in this mess. Kawas sprays down Shaz and Desainty responds. Four AKs, one AWP from Fury Academy on the mid lane. Default smoke in the window. King V here playing under window. That's going to be an entry. And still, he's not retreating. He's just holding his position. And also Kawas is down. Shaz spots his opponent's barrel, sprays the second. He got spotted and Shaz. Gonna be Rambo's here from Mello. Checks his opponent and gets him. Finally, the sniper from Oplano is down in the window. That's gonna be a good start for Fury Academy. Sandy also spots his opponent on the stairs. Cowers will die to that. So, what's going to be the plan now for your academy? The Senti holding a really good angle here. Oh, nice one from Kai. Finally, Kel, who hasn't, though, trades the guy from the palace. If your academy they decide that maybe Oplano just simply reinforced A site, and B might be, free, might be free. Maybe there's only one guy playing, and they're not wrong. Roninho checks. Clears the angles. But the problem is that he's alone there now. He spots his opponent and also Zombie was waiting for a push. But Nino might successfully get his opponent off guard. Catch his mom off guard. That's what he does. There's going to be a bomb planted. With Nino. Might be the second one. Oh, Shaz is extremely low. It's still winnable. It's still actually winnable. Shaz is down to 1 HP. Bring his full. Just 1 bullet to the core to the body just one bullet and bringing you he probably knows i think he knows i think he feels and shaz when it was made there let me now try for flashes three players in the city from all plano They have 30 seconds on the clock. They have a lot of time to use. Loop with an entry. It spots his opponent also spacing down this, this Sandy. Zombie with a trade. Kai was successful to get his opponent here from City. PNG. Isn't it clutching 1v2? But 13 seconds left on the clock only. We need to move and I believe it's going to be safe here. Just no time left for KNG in this round to win. So just saving the op. It's gonna be the only option here. But all the positions is real hard to clear. And that's gonna be try number two. But this time Piriazin sprays his opponent down through the smoke and zombie farewell. See you next round. Shaz another kill on Mello. Finally, Bruninho spots his opponent on the city. Kawas playing on Tetris. We'll get double thanks to Kai and his flash. The bomb has been planted and 
numbers are for Fury Academy now. So Oplan are not rushing things down. NJ will get a kill here. Two people left. One's on connector. Oh, nice quick scope from KNG coming out. There's going to be hope here. But I believe Bruninho. Bruninho will be spotted. Killing loop. And another spray successfully gets. Quer ganhar 5 dólares de graça? Então entre agora no Skins Monkey, logue com sua Steam utilizando o link da descrição e clique em receber gratuitamente 5 dólares. E pronto. Se você tiver skins que não curte mais no seu inventário, o site é perfeito para você trocar suas skins que já enjoou em skins novas do seu gosto. Você vai ganhar até 40% de bônus utilizando o cupom ARTS para suas trades e dar uma moral pro canal, né? Agora não perde tempo, bora farmar suas skins novas para fazer aqueles highlights insanos. E lembrando, todas as trades de fevereiro vão ocorrer ao sorteio exclusivo. Para participar, é só enviar um print da sua trade no meu Instagram. Tamo junto, guys, e vamos para o vídeo de hoje. There's loop, with them four. Drew's back immediately. And for counter flash, and Bruninho uses the drill well. That's gonna be a decent start once again for Furia. Oh my goodness, Furia has him with a trade, but zombie. Response immediately and delivers this final, this final so needful kill. To get B-side absolutely fully under Furia control. And I believe that's not gonna last forever. As we're already at round 14. Moving straight forward through the Molotovs, losing a lot of health. Just the department rushing B down. Guy already with the spray on loop. Loop of the kill though. There's some good news off our planner here. Kuriazin. Finally reinforces B. And also survived. Descendi finally with two kills here. We put a potential push and look at how Plano are playing. They're playing pretty extremely defensively. It's gonna be the made contact. Ringo was expecting. That's gonna spray the second guy down too. No, so Mel with the kill. Against four fully armed up players. Crosses the zombie scope and. So that's how it goes. Mello plays extremely aggressively, but oh, Mello! Double kill from this USP guy. And only after King G enters the fight, it's gonna be a trade. He was also got spotted, descending Priazin. Entered A side. Priazin was also double kill. That was the Dolberetas. A little tricky to shoot from this kind of distance here. Descend it also. Was really far. And moves already from backline from city. Knows where Kawes is. And this guy got cornered. Nice flash from KNG. That's gonna be the piss around. Walking, down, walking towards the catwalk, Bruninho with MP9, closes the distance, closes the gap on the second one too, and meanwhile, Kawas and Loop traded one for one. Isanti finally reacts to Kai's movement. Get him down, Bruninho, also spots his opponent, will try to swing him, but Isanti was ready for that, and only now we can see the situation. This might be a really still tough round to get as Mello strikes immediately. Gets down Shaz. Will probably get the second. Yes, he will. And also Zombie. Picks immediately after that. Riazin was unlucky not to get the skill from the palace. The zombie barely survived. And Descent is left alone. So that's gonna be the start from Kawes. Zombie was also being tagged by AWP. Shaz, though, was ready to make a trade. Down to 46 HP, still alive. With the bomb going towards B side where Reninho plays. So that's gonna be... So that might be a little problem here. Yeah, Reninho was not... Was expecting his opponent to came here. Can't say the same about his opponent for now. A zombie. Also dead to Desanti. Kai will use this opportunity perfectly. It's going to be bomb on the ground lying in the smoke. It's 3v2 and 7 seconds on the clock. Oh, Plano, they can make it. That's going to be round number 15 for Fury Academy. So far, Fury looking really good. Ramp. 
And Ada will play from the palace. Well, zombies might be in danger here. If you got swung from the palace white, we just not survive that. No, and now the reinforcements come to Fury. And zombie already with entry, by the way. We has him with the trade, though. So things are looking neck to neck. Zombie. Almost died to that. E63, Briazin finishes him off. So now the city is clear. Oh, nice kill from Melo. So far. And only now <laughs> we can see the smoke opens up on connector. Well, that might be a little, little bit late. So Briazin here on the side. Melo waits for his opponent to make a mistake. But the problem is that Oplana now they have a little big advantage with the time. Melo needing to use this wisely. Melo, nice start. This Sandy also compromises his position in the connector. And barely survived that. It might be literally the last round. And it's gonna be the last round of Mirage in Fury Academy's favor. There's gonna be 16 to 8. Fury Academy. Oplano gonna perform on the attacker side already pushing outside or secret and here comes the first contact made and also king g getting zombie here bringing you as the reinforced spear and kai still holds potential swing here gets to the off angle getting baited for that here comes the swing for descending nice shooting here from this guy finally and for now no response but here we go Kawes with Dolberetas. On the kill number one. Furias and Dao trades. Maintaining this double numbers advantage. Kawes still continues. Just goes forward with his uh, Dolberetas. Feeling good. Then 2v3 players. Sandy already with the kill. Kawes with the trade. That's going to be a quadra kill. That's going to be actually quadra kill. And it's all down to 1v1. Right away here. Pissed around. Well, he knows. Loop. He doesn't believe. He doesn't believe. There's gonna be another tap. Not if he skits. He just doesn't believe. Now he picks! Tessic is left on the clock. Kawas is, is hurt so badly. Tries to shoot his opponent down, but there's only five seconds on the clock left, and it's gonna be round number one for Oplano. So all the smokes. Nice spray, zombie. Was a little bit uh, too curious here. And Mello strikes two people down from outside. Nosakawis moves through the smoke, getting shas without any possible problem. But oh no, Piriasin comes back from the secret. Clears him up. So it's now, after all the trades, down to 2v2 situation. With one minute on the timer. Saplano can stay... Close to the B side, waiting for a potential push and checking angles from Furia like Kai did. You can swap the gun. It's all down to 1v1, PNG, but he knows. And Mello! But once again, can, uh, can the change as Kawas finds an entry here. Almost burns down, but half health survives. He might also get caught by descending with the spray in here. Well, also Mallow pushes down the secret, finding Piriaz in there. Was not expecting the sniper to do this kind of play. Now it's the usual or not. Also, even outside, KNG doing a really good job clearing the back line. But when you need capitalizing his position on the hunt, there's gonna be double for him. It's all down to key and G. So the bomb. And the visual. Mel watches quickly for a swing. The save mine from Beer Sound. Look at Kai. That plays really aggressive. That's gonna be key and G. Dead as a result. Also, I think Piri Yazen will might respond. Kai survives. The same thing can we say about the Santi. It's gonna be an AK. The zombie will maintain his position here on the box. Shaz pecks him on the short one. But dies to Kawes. 
And after all the trades, we're down to 2v2 situation. Mallow with AWP watching. There's going to be a kill on the loop swinging him. But where's Piriazin? Where's this guy? He's in main. That's spotted by Kawa. Sprays him down with M. So now Plan is starting to push secret towards B side. KNG with the lurk. I believe Kai will get the first contact here. Dodge the flash. Moninho also with an entry. Kai gets loop. And you know what? KNG was the lurker. He was dead first. Well, that may be a problem. But still, Plano manages to get uh, to B side. Plant the bomb. But look at chance position here. But he won't be able to leave long enough to get the second kill. They're all down to 2v2. Piriazin does such a great job here. Standing in full open. Kai might catch the first contact here. Dodges the flash. Was not checked. Drops immediately. Tries to survive. Tries to get to the safe place. Smokes his position off. Well, that's a nice start for Furia. The only thing Kai need to do is just try to stay alive more. And he can! There's gonna be a triple kill for Kai. As a result... Of this precise play. So, plan uh, so Fury Academy trying to be really careful. The Sandy is spraying his opponent down. But Kao's. Kao's knows. He even sees the will. But he's with MP9 and he's still. Manages to get this kill, King G though, with a WP, but Zombie was absolutely unexpected to still challenge two opponents. Try to outnumber him. For now it's a uh, distance start once again for a Plano loop already with an entry. Here goes the second one, Kawas also dies. Kai with a trade, but uh, Key NG with AWPs. Real hard to ouch it. So bringing your metal left alone against four people from Oplano alive. This in the more throws B. And she clears mellow. So that means that bringing you will stay alone here, trying to save his M4. Here we go, it's gonna be an execution on a finally bringing you with double kill. It's gonna be a really decent one, but the Santi Puriazin immediately trades this back, maintaining their dominance of numbers. Let me drop, uh, I believe, uh, Mellow. What? What just happened? Now, once again, Fury decides to play aggressively. The Mellow. Already dead. Look at the aggression here coming from Bruninho. Works well, but Zombie was a little bit maybe too aggressive. So Kenji takes him down with Tech 9. Here he has and finally gets Bruninho. It's down to 4v2. Double numbers advantage, and uh, I believe uh, Aplano. So that's gonna be it. Gets an entry. Melo though was unable to survive that. Also shots with the second kill. I believe zombie might die to this too, but chance is not much help left. <laughs> Look at that zombie with MP9 was also expected from the secret. Oplano are just outplaying their opponents on every single level possible. Kaos is down to half health. And Kinji also pushes forward. So it's gonna be really hard. Director, please fix this. <laughs> That's weird. It's gonna bamboozle people here. I'm gonna write him down. To change this thing quickly. And for now, um, let's see what go what's going on here in the second piece around Chaz and Piriazan. His zombie in Kawa's 2v2 situation. So now we got things back on track. Okay, Piriazan. These Berettas gets Kawa. Also, zombie here defending the bomb on B side and six. Kai. 
almost dead to that. Loop escapes. It's gonna be an A push. Bringing yo. It's a nice kill here. GNG. Makes his play. And also Descendi does the same. So it's down to 3v3. Bomb is blended here in the middle of the open. That is down to 2 HP. Well, do they kill? Actually, Piriazin was not ready for this active play from Kai. Kai, what are you doing? That's going to be the second one for him. Being absolutely at zero health. So that's going to be... Isn't to die to Kawas. Probably survives, but still maintains his position. Also loops with the kill and Shaz with the answer. Shaz with double already. Bomb is on the ground. And I believe that's going to be it. Kai will get the final... Now it's going to be rushed here, coming from a plan on, on A side. Now here. Dodges the flash. Plays it by the way perfectly, but something was wrong with the shooting, though. Okay, finally got the key in G. Bruninho with double kill already from his USP. Bruninho! Only with the third kill. Piriazin got the timing right. He's left alone against four people. Bomb is on the ground. And I believe. No, he will finish Bruninho off finally, but... Three people still left on the side. Kawas will start the execution right away just now. Melo starts this perfectly. Descent to trades. And look at showers. What is going on in the showers? Shaz there. Let's take nine. Probably see. Yeah, he says the barrel. He sees the barrel. He gets Kawas. He gets season four. Well, that's going to be an interesting strat still. Anyway, Zombie. What's about his opponent here near showers on the mid lane? Gets one kill. Immediately got traded by Priyazin. So that's going to be the signal after all the utilities is out. Went towards A. Now all the rotation was made by Furia. It's Priyazin. Where's the bomb? Here goes the, here goes the nade. Um, uh, it could be painful, but... Went it back. Nice flash, actually, by Piriazin. And Descendi doing a really good job here. Nice trace here, finally. Look at that. Mello with double kill, though. But Mello with winning in 1v1. He's watching for a potential, po potential push, potential lurker. The execution is going to be here. On B side, Mello already with an entry. Descendi answers. Roninho. Also with a kill. Mello gets the second one here. Oh, nice 3k already. PNG. Left alone with his AK, plus his opponent zombie in heaven. But the smoke will expire any second, and he knows that. He tries to up his opponent, moves forward. He's on the rush. Gets zombie here. Three seconds left only. He has no time. And Mello is unreachable. Moves forward. Being unspotted, gets one. Goes back immediately. Here's the second one. He's going to be swung from both sides, I believe. Oh, he won't. There's going to be a bomb on the ground. He's in his eyes. And just look at this. Oplado's just going one by one. And Kawas farms them easily. Only Piriazin. Finally. Gets to the boost. Gets to the bag. But Mallow already pushed it. Misses the shot. It's incredible. Already pushing monster. Piriazin is already on the side. But I believe he's going to miss one. Nice flick. Right between the eyes. So 38 seconds on the clock. Not the few things, by the way. And also Kai dies. But oh, Bruninho! And once again, there's no room for arrow left. It's already the third map. Of course, yeah, the lower bracket still exists, but I don't think uh, there is. I don't think there is a player or the team who actually considers this as a not possible option. So for now, it's a decent start and um, nice pick from Shaz. Picking from the door, getting double kill. So here, Academy, two players alive on B. Bruninho will maybe try to execute one more a miracle. And yes, they are. They actually are. It's down to 1v1. The Saint is tacked. It's 1v1. It's an absolutely unexpected thing to do. The Saint. Carlos again, pretty aggressive. Extremely, I would say, aggressive. Look at this. But this time, he was expected. The Saint in loop doing a really good job here. Getting entries. 
And what is more important, surviving. This is down to 11 or the 743. Chess and loop. So there's going to be a question if there's going to be a problem. Or maybe some will get one. We'll get two. So two low HP players are down. This also can say that he is an extremely healthy man. But anyway, even with a rough start, Furia recovers. So I believe there's going to be an execution on A. So Nessar out. Nice. Kills here coming in from KNG. But Kai with double strikes back. KNG also with a double already. Spots his opponent and sprays him down. His key NG. They're just waiting for a pun to make a move. And look at this. B already has been pushed. Kai tries to survive. He knows that he's extremely low HP, but it's going to be really hard to do that against Loop. Bringing it though. He's one. We'll get the second one. This one will be on, on the ground. Look at this. Shaz is here fighting. Fighting for his life, but not against Melo. He's with his scout. And he NG is left alone. Oh. We'll catch his opponent off guard. Melo. I spent his opponent in the smoke. His already favorite position. He's been already checked here. But for now, Piriasen starts really decent for his team. Melo, though, responds with double. Inji and Shaz are immediately dead. Chaos also hears his opponent. It was not checked to loop. Was killed immediately. Kawas goes forward, getting Descenti. And as an outcome, Piriazian is gonna also fall down to Kawas coming from behind. Greenio was his opponent. He NG. So did that Chaz. Was also checked by Kawas. Look at this. Look how Fury play. Oh, that's incredible. They send it here, but Dolberetas will get one. Let's stay alive, but bringing is on the hunt. Bring you. Yes, they sent it down. Lips also responds. Getting mellow. But Kai is already in other way than expected. For now, it seems like Fury is just going straight forward through the monster. I believe Shaz uh, will find one. Yes, and also Loop will get mellow. Shaz with double already. And I believe that's it for this round. Fury Academy just falling apart. Because these kind of strats worked really well on Demi Rush. Pushing showers, pushing mid lane. Descent is finally supposed his opponent. Mellow also already on. A long, bringing also with the kill. Descent he didn't enter, but still doesn't really matter. Pereasin tries to trade, getting mellow, bringing him down. But zombie responds, and as the outcome, one of the two players alive. And 35 seconds on the clock. So, are in a pretty tricky spot. So Rinya gets no one exit here. And also Zombie. Well, he tried. Loop with AK will try to save his gun. Oh, I like here. Position here. Oh, Zombie. Literally King G. How did you not kill him? Zombie just even spent extra money. <laughs> oh, dear. That was an unfortunate moment. And also Zombie got the second kill there. On the side A. Are setting up for Monster Push once again. I believe. So it's going to be one more straightforward round. Comes the, comes the nade. Look at the start here. So that's straight one to one. Chaz was also risking a lot. But survived. Kai is down to 33. Rainier is down to 78. And Fear Academy, they are still setting up there. 
Checking their backline. I so, like the mellow. Slowly but surely push a short. You have to catch the timing right. It be extremely important to win the round to enter the site. Mellow. Yeah, Piriazin. That was one of the anchors. Here comes the smoke in heaven. And I believe here we go. There's gonna be there's gonna be rush. Chas, a desperate try to clear the short. But Bruninho was ready for this pick. There's gonna be another kill for Kawas. I managed to plant the bomb. They're making a lot of sound there. Yeah, Kaibo with an entry. King G dies. Well, King G suffers this game. He just simply can't. He tries, but something all the time goes wrong. Descent of a double kill, by the way. That's a nice tray, but I believe Kawis will equalize the digits with both teams. Kawis moving forward. You're holding a push. And I like the idea. Look at this. These guys are extremely patient. And I think they don't know, but Brunino will swing a loop with a kill. Oblano continue to hold their positions. And that's going to be a rotation towards A side. Where Shaz with his MP9, he's have HP, and I believe he's not expected, but here comes the contact, I believe. Wait, wait a second, Piriaz in there. Piriaz in with Famas. Bomb, Bomb has been planted. And I believe they don't know about this. They don't know. Th look at this, Piriaz. Look at this mistiming. I don't know if he's gonna be watched. I don't know if he's gonna be watched. Look at that zombie! Was expecting that, or I don't know, we're just lucky a bit. Kao is still. It's just two. It's all down to loop. It's win or lose. Ladies and gentlemen, 90 seconds, 19 seconds on the clock left. Who gets one? Here comes the flash. Kao is fakes. And loop also taps the bomb. Seven seconds. Five seconds. Four. He's not gonna make it, but loop! Wait a second, what a swing! What a swing with him!